not enough room. There's not enough bridge between his elbow and my chest to break it. Sit back a little bit. Oh, all this room, all this way to break his elbow. If I'm here, I'm pushing against my chest. Look, now there's a little bridge. I connect, catch it with my trap and my head. Easy tap him off. Takes nothing. I like doing this. Very good, since I have you here. So, side mount number E. So that's if he used this arm. So he can't use this arm. If it's straight, I got him. If he bends it over my face, I got him. He's like, no, I'm not gonna do that. So what does he do? He gets his elbow in. Now I go to side mount number two. Now, he wants to get to his hand here. Everybody come on this side. Oops, sorry. So I'm here. He gets his hand there. Yeah, now I can stay here. He's too much space. Go ahead, go. Yeah, he easily gets his knee in there. So I'm on side mount two. He's doing exactly what he wants. He gets to his hand. Now, I'm going to show you what not to do and what to do. What everybody does is we do this, we go here, I think he knows this, I slide in and I have my chest facing up. Now he uses his number three here, he pushes my face away, push it right by the ear, make me look. Now, all he's gonna do is walk his feet this way. Walk, walk, on. You know what I mean? So look, I get that hand in there, he switches his base. Boom, look, he gave me my number three, I push him this way. Now I walk. Flip. Done. I love it when people switch their base on me in case I could tell me whatever you call it. I don't know what So if you didn't get that hand on me, so we'll practice this on here and my chest. Look, I gave him all the room in the world. Push my face, walk, walk. Yeah, darn me. That's the way everyone does it. That's the way I don't want you to do it. So if you got anything from the seminar, don't do that. The way I want to do it is he has my hand on me. I keep my shoulder facing down. Look, boom. I don't give him any room for his number three to come in, to come in. Here. Now, my hand comes over, I block the face. My leg comes over and I sit here. Now, he's, he's you okay? Yep. Now I'm on his tricep. Now I have everything. Now I have this tricep, I have this tricep. One. Two, look, everybody come over here. Notice I'm sitting right on his face. I'm not down here. One, I grab my leg, hip forward for the arm bar. If I miss the arm, I have a wrist lock. You can't move this arm, it's stuck. Now this triceps block too, look. Same move as I did a minute ago. I cut my arm, use my, use my upper body to go down, boom. Let's start there. So, side mount two, he gets his hand in. Practice the wrong way, wrong way. Bang, make him look this way, yeah. I don't even snake him. He's just walking this way, he's walking in a circle. Now we do it the right way. Bang, my shoulders stay down. Lock the head. Look, my head comes right down, my knee. I wanna follow my principle. My knee has to go right on his shoulder, I sit. All my weight is on his tricep and on his head. He can't move here. Go ahead, move. Bang, done. So one, one, two, three. You guys got it? You see it again? One more time. Long way and right way? Long way. He gets his hand there. To get this too, he's gonna have a good base here. I open up my hips, give him room to pick it up. Slide in, oh, I did it wrong. Make sure, yeah, make sure I'm looking this way. He just walks, walks in the circle. Keeps his arms straight the whole time. Very easy uh, reversal. The right way, I open up my hip, I give him space, I can take his arm off, come high, lock, step over, look. My knee comes down. I have his tricep. Boom, one, two, three, four. And we can keep, we'll keep going from there a little bit. Guys, got it? One, two.